Okay, a can-do attitude, if you will, this morning with Cleto Rodriguez. Let's check in and find out where's Cleto. Hey guys, that's right. I'm here at Construction Careers Academy where they're getting geared up for Thanksgiving. They're helping out and doing their part. I'm here with Miss Ackles. You guys have a can drive that you got going on. It's pretty intense. Tell me a little bit about that and what you guys got going on. I love coming out here because y'all always have something going on. And it's, again, from the students themselves. So Quarter Moon gave us a call and they wanted to partner with uh, the Raul Jimenez uh, Thanksgiving dinner. And we took it as a challenge and had a lot of fun with it. Our different strands um, all competed basically Mr. Paul's construction management strand. They, they were the winners um, of, this, of this friendly competition, so it was a lot of fun. And uh, again, this is, uh, this is just half of the class, right? No, <laughs> this, no. The, the other half is right over here. His name's Christian. <laughs> so, uh, Christian is trying hard not to breathe. He wants to tear that shirt. Kick, kick. So you guys, what else do you guys have going on here? I mean, as you guys know, we've always come back here and we've highlighted and showcased the tiny homes, the, the what is it, the containers that you guys turn into a home. I mean, every, you guys step it up every time. What else do you have down the line? So, uh, again, this year we'll do our tiny house showcase and we're going to uh, show some tiny homes. This year, what we thought would be cool, it's a thing, is a man cave and a she shed. Nice. And uh, we're also going to do a little hunter's cabin as well. So we'll have a lot to show at this year's showcase in May and, um, and a lot of different projects going on. I tell you, one of the things that I really enjoy is the fact that they all, the students do this and they do it for a grade. But I tell you what, it's not, one thing I notice is that nah, it's not just the precision of everything and the perfection of it, but the passion behind it. They all put everything into it. Not this class so much, but the other, no, I'm just kidding. I mean, they, they actually do everything in detail. Like I, I saw something last year that was so amazing and it was a, a little tiny home. I said, this is perfect. And he goes, nah, I got to put some more tile down. I'm like, what? what? I'm like, this is great. And we're going to, guys, when we come back uh, we're gonna have a special take a good look at this gentleman right here oh. yeah cuz that hair might not be here when we come back that's right someone lost a bet we'll find out when we come back we'll send it back to you guys Ooh. we're gonna have to wait to find out the beard or the head that's a no or shave bow. no shave November that he's got going on that's a good yeah. uh, we'll find out a live that's right. uh, live haircut on the show here coming up I hope Cletho is not the one doing it <laughs> we'll see exactly Okay, this is the moment maybe we've been waiting for. No more beard to beard or not to beard, or, or just shaving someone's head. To hair or not to hair, a live no. haircut on the show. That's what Cleto has been teasing for us. So the question is, who's gonna get it? Well, Mr. Paul's gonna get it. Yeah, that's oh. right. He uh, had a little incentive there. I'm here. Let me introduce you to Annie and Ollie, who is gonna go. There was a couple of students here at CCA, which is uh, Construction Careers Academy, and there's Mr. Paul himself right there. Go ahead, guys. This is the moment. Of, to tell me a little bit about how this came about, Annie. So at no, first, Ollie, Ollie, there you go. <laughs> no. So at first, it was it was all a joke. So yeah. we were like, oh yeah, like if we win, like you should, you should. It started off with shaving his beard because he never does that. Yeah. And then all of a sudden, the seniors came in one day and was like, nah, like you should, because he has an action figure. You should okay. do a mohawk. Show him the action figure, what y'all trying to get it look like. Yeah. <laughs> now, how did, how did, how was the contest for you guys? How did you like? Uh, the contest was honestly really fun, especially because like we had students where every day we're like, oh wait, wait, hey. <laughs> so the competition was really cool because we had students coming in every day. We're like, did you bring in your yams? Where's your yams? Like, come on, man, where's your yams? <laughs> and so it was just so fun. Like the competition was really amazing. How many yams did you guys collect? I believe we collected 3,250 plus. Wow, and that's all going to the Jimenez dinner. So that's pretty cool. Awesome, guys. And again, hey. I heard he has a little bit of a, he has a little bit of a shaky hand there, Mr. Paul. So, you know, so if you could go, if you could put where's Cleth on the side of his head, that'd be great. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Yeah, you are. Go ahead, just go all in there. Hey, get that first one, and you're good. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, you know what? When we when we come back, we're gonna finally. Hopefully, we'll see the other side done. We'll see. It'll be done. Oh, like, I send it back to you. Yeah, because right now it looks like he's got that cool, like trendy haircut. You know, yeah. like it's shorter on the sides, longer in the front. Yes. Um. So it doesn't look bad. Yeah. Okay. Like but, like me, right, Bianca? Like me. Yeah, you. I, you're know, always I, I told my wife that I wanted to. 
I want to get my hair like like Keanu Reeves in Speed. I never heard somebody laugh so hard in their life. Oh, Keanu so, Reeves yeah, Speed. We'll see. I see. Oh, wow. That's he's going way back. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you. Very well, there he is, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, man. We will see. We will do, have our uh, haircut cam going here. Yeah. All right. Trimmed up and a uh, little mohawk. He's got a little edge going on. I think it's a holiday cut, uh, getting ready for Thanksgiving oh, next week. But, but it's not Cleto Rodriguez go, getting the new do this morning. Hello, sir. <laughs> no, that's right. It's Mr. Paul here. Look at that. Looks just like the little action figure here. How you feel, Mr. Paul? <laughs> like a new man. <laughs> Everybody got a piece of, you know, taking off your hair there. Yeah, uh, our principal, Mr. Edge, came in and, and uh, got it started a little too too much, but yeah, <laughs> they had fun. That's what it was about. I tell you what, congratulations. You guys did a wonderful thing here. You, you. raised about 33 pounds of yams going to the Raul. 3,300, that's right. Pounds of yams going to... We have Patricia Jimenez here from Rebel Things uh, Jimenez Dinner. Tell me what this means to you guys and, I mean, all the help here. It means so much. We have so much support from the community, and we're so grateful to CCA, the students, the staff, Quarter Moon Plumbing for this collaborative effort. Every can will be put to good use in feeding 25,000 people this Thanksgiving Day. Awesome. Let me get Quarter Moon in here. Now, how, how, how's it? Thank you so much for your involvement. How does this, what does this mean for you guys? Uh, we've been a part of uh, Raul Jimenez now for 10 years. Uh, we've been a part of CCA. So it's just part of this whole community thing that we love being a part of. And uh, it's just great to see the kids getting involved, the next generation contributing to the city of San Antonio. It's wonderful. I mean, it's one of those things. Guys, guys, give yourselves a big round of applause for coming through. You guys raised the bar. And... Uh, Thank you guys for coming out. And again, we will see Patricia next week as uh, I'll be volunteering to help out. Yeah, because, you know, it's, it's never, it's never going to, who's going to base the turkeys but me? You know what I mean? No, I'm just kidding. All right, guys, we'll go ahead and uh, send it back to you. Look at that haircut again. Look at the haircut. I like it. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Yeah. It looks good. He does look like Get the action figure. Is that Sheamus, I believe, the WWE superstar? Double check, but uh, that's it. Look at the show. Them the show. Them the yeah, yeah. The, there it is. There great. it is. Right there. Because we do have SmackDown on Fox on Friday, so I just gotta get that shameless plug in here. That's right. Thank you very much. Okay. Cool okay. deal. Okay.